the lighting okay? Yo, what's going on with you YouTube? Jumping Chris here. We're coming back at y'all with another vid. And today, we're here in Hartsville, Ohio. We're about like maybe 20 minutes away from Akron, I think. And we're a couple miles way up to Cleveland or something. I'm supposed to go. I'm going to go to a sneaker event down in uh, Hartsville, Hartsville, Ohio, going to the Sneakersville uh, that's going to be happening today. And then also I want to announce that I'll also be in Miami on uh, July 31st for the sneaker feats. So make sure you guys pull up. And I'm also going to be the week, the following week will be in Tampa. And Tampa will be at the Sneaker Travelers. Uh, if you guys do want to go, if you guys are going to go to the Sneaker Travelers or plan on going to Sneaker Travelers, make sure you guys use my discount code JUMPERMAN10. Save you about 15% off on tickets. Save you about 15% off. But anyway, so today's release, guys, is going to, was the Electric Orange. Now, this one's kind of one of those shoes that it's kind of like, eh, it, you know, I think, my opinion, I think Nike dropped the ball on this shoe. Like, these could have been like... I get what Nike's doing, and they're really, really smart about it, and it just kind of is what it is. I'm pretty sure these shoes are going to sell out, and so on and so forth, whatever, right? But anyways, it's Electric Orange. I did end up getting a W on Foot Locker, so I'm actually pretty excited for that. Like, hey, you know how tough it is to get shoes nowadays. I did end up getting a W on the Electric Orange here in Ohio, I believe. I don't know which mall it is, but I got to go out and pick it up. I think it's like maybe an hour away good lord because uh we're in hartsfield there's not many a lot of foot lockers around and this is probably the only place I can get it so i gotta go up there and pick them up and everything uh and like is it really worth it i guess i'm just more doing it for the content i already did a review and everything so if you guys want to check that out on the channel i did like an early unboxing and an early on feet review and all that good stuff detail review and like i said about this shoe this is just one of those shoes it's it's just a little disappointing for most people. I'm not. I'm sure some people's gonna like it and some people's not. But you know, for me as an OG head, and I do have the shattered backwards, which I plan on wearing at the show. You know what I mean? Like I have the shattered just because this release, and I also got a fit to go with it too. V long, what's up? But yeah, I, I kind of wish that whole white block would have been this color, or at least an orange or something. You know, like that would have been monumental. Like that could have been like. This release could have been one of the greatest this year's if they did it right. But again, it is what it is. They did it the way they did it. It's white and it's you know we see mock-up pictures. It, uh, I thought it was gonna be if it was gonna be like the mock-up pictures, those could have been fire. But it's not. So it's just gonna be it's just an electric orange. And hey, they're still gonna sell out. I'm not sure. I think they're bricking. To be honest, I think they're only going for a little bit over retail. So if you guys really want these things and you guys end up taking L's, they're really not that expensive. And I'm sure they're gonna go down uh, even more probably. I don't know. But hey, but don't sleep, man. Uh, this I'll talk about it in another video. But I think this could be one of those shoes that go up potentially. Who knows? But anyways, we're gonna go out. We're gonna go pick these up at the mall, and we're here in. Hartsville, Ohio. Okay, here we go. This is here we here we have it. Man, I did not wake up early enough to pick these up in the area. You know, I won these in Cleveland, bro. Yeah. And that's like, I think it's like an hour and a half from here. And uh -huh. I was like, do I really want to pick these up? Drive an hour and a half there and drive it back. My man's here, have it. I appreciate yes, sir. it. Yes, How much sir. your lanes go for? Just wondering. 260. You're crazy, bro. <laughs> there's, there's no way you're. Are you for real? Yeah. 260? What are yeah. they going for? Know, what size like is this? 230. That's a 10. 230? Yeah, that's what I, they're like marketing. Yeah, uh, hold up, bro. Let me okay. look at the price. Get it on the show and stuff, but here we go. Oh, they actually went up. Okay. I guess all the L's, 230, you take the buy, buy now price. So that's the price if you were to buy it. So it's like right there, 257 VXC. It's about if you were to pay like 
you know, with the stock X and P's and all that good stuff. So I get that. Yeah. And we're in a show, guys. So that's pretty much what it is. But anyways, um, here you guys have it. These are the electric orange. I did do a review. What do you think? Can you compare these two? Like. I know. <laughs> right, facts. Oh man. I low key am not the biggest fan of the all all white. I thought they were gonna do the black toe, like the orange here, black here, and kept it like that, like the black toe, like the mock-up picks, you know what I mean? But they didn't. Anyways, um I it, I did end up winning online a couple pairs. Did you hit any? What do you think in a couple of months could these go up? I'd say so, yeah. It's going into the fall. It might be one of the shoes that might go up. Right, right. It might go up. Did I hit No, I didn't get I didn't get any W on sneakers, but I got some on like uh, a couple other sites and stuff like that. So that's what I did this morning. I decided to go go online and go this morning. But anyways, here it is guys. Appreciate you bro. Hold on, let me do my thumbnail. Back at the hotel real quick. Um sorry guys. I literally was at a, a sneaker event down here in Ohio, uh, Hartsville, Ohio. It's called Sneakerville, and uh, one of the vendors had uh, the pair in, at the table. It's like, okay, bet. So now I don't have to drive all the way to Cleveland and pick them up because I was like, man, do I really want to pick these up? And I was like, because it's like an hour and a half away. So it was an hour and a half there and then an hour and a half back, and then I got to go to the event and then you know vlog that so I was kind of like trying to save time because it's always about timing man so that's why the, the grind is it, you gotta figure things out you know what I mean but anyways about the sneaker I don't I keep hating to sound like I'm dog on the shoe by any means because it does sound like I'm really complaining and everything I still think it's fine it is fine it just had a lot of potential that I saw that it missed you know and I'm a you know an OG sneaker head that I'm so used to like you know like stuff like you know like 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 this and we had the 2.0s which is amazing and then we had the satins and then of course we had the 3.0s which I'm still a little disappointed about but you know it's all good we just kind of accept it and now the this one and this one was just kind of it's not my favorite that's all I'll say talking about resale price earlier um they I saw they kind of went up a little bit uh, they were like at 200 yesterday and now they're like at I think it's like 220, 230. I do expect prices to keep going down. Like, um, if you were to sell on the apps, you know, after fees and stuff like that, you're basically making your money back. So to me, it's kind of like lunch money bricks, you know. Um, is it? That's why I was saying, like, was it worth it to me to drive all the way up to an hour and a half to cop to grab it, you know? And I already have a pair coming. Shouts to my guy, sold a cart. He actually did hit for me because I was like, yo, I'm at this event. I don't know how I'm gonna get these things, and I didn't think I was gonna get a W on the flex app, but. It's all good, um, but still, this shoe, if you guys want me to do a hold and sell video, uh, comment down below, I might do a hold and sell, but this shoe might potentially, later down the long road, these things could do some numbers, like like, like out of nowhere, you know, just kind of like how, what happened with the, uh, the 3.0s, and if you were to invest in this, it's kind of cheap, you know what I mean, like it's not that expensive, but me, I think, personally me, I don't want to invest in this shoe. You know, I, I think I'm gonna pass. If I might get some pairs here and there for like for retail, I might cop. Or if I get it under retail, I might grab maybe one or two couple here. You know, just to see if I can move it on the table or something. But other than that, I don't think I really want to invest in this shoe. But hey, it's up to you guys. What do you guys think? Uh, I'm gonna try to do some more research and get the feel for it. But like I said, if you want me to do a whole sale video, comment down below and I'll get that done. Anyway, guys, I gotta go to this event down in Hartsville and Sneakerville, and then, yeah, man. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I appreciate y'all, love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below, and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on my social media, at Chris on IG, sometimes on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all, love y'all. I'm Jumpin' Chris. Peace.